Good morning everybody, it's Cassie and welcome to um, another unboxing video and it is the 15th so that means it's time for Luxbox. Yay! I used to stay up like all night for these but midnight for Second Lifetime is 3am for me so it just was becoming harder and harder each month to do it. So it's 7.30am now and I figured it's time to open stuff. <laughs> Yay! Um, the lineup for this round is freaking amazing like I am so excited each round is always so good I always love all the designers in this but like they put a few of my like absolutely favorite designers in the world on here too so I'm really excited this round so an opener box I haven't seen a thing I've been avoiding spoilers like as much as possible uh, but uh, Candy Doll did post a group gift on Flickr so if you go to their main store it is just for uh, this event you can get it for free so we have blueberry candy doll sinful empire foxes john lamb moon paper arrow company roan scarlet creative and tart and oh my gosh this looks so good oh my gosh like i'm so excited for all this i want to open it all now like oh i love it look at those pants and the lamb hair and that one piece, oh my gosh, I'm just so excited, everything's going to fit so well, like all these designers are so ace. So, um, let's click them all, and I'm going to pause it for you guys, you don't have to see me wait, because when you do click these, it does take like a few seconds to load. I can't explain, see right there, 7 seconds, I can't explain what Luxbox is for people that still don't know what it is. Luxbox comes out the 15th of every month, and it is a subscription box. All you do is pay a group 1500 linen to join, and you get a box like this. If you ever uh, see the um, box after it's already come out, for 24 hours you can buy it for 3000 linen, or you can wait the next month and join again for 1500 and buy any previous box for 2000 linen. So like I know it probably sounds expensive like when I say it all like at once like that, but it's really an amazing deal. All of these are like fat packs. They are so well done. They are super unique and just for this box and I am such a massive fan. So I I have been doing this for a year, 13 months now because this was my first ever video when I did it was Luxbox and it's still one of my favorite events to do and I fully always support it. I really feel like this is like one of the boxes that you need to get um, and <laughs> obviously I, I get so excited for these that I wake up ridiculously early to do these um, although I guess 730 isn't really that early. <laughs> Can we talk about how amazing that Roan dress down there looks, too? Oh my gosh, I am so excited. <sighs> Alright, I got di distracted. So, on the 15th, when um, you are opening up this box, um, or when you when it does turn midnight, um, it'll show up in your group notice. So you pay the group 1500 and then uh, you can chat with people and be super friendly in that group. Um, and then on the 15th they'll send out this box in a notice um, if it ever doesn't go through you can check your notices and get it again and then um, it will come to you there if you can't find it you can always go into people groups and then uh, Luxbox info and it'll be right here where you grab it the group is also really cool where they do flicker a photo of the day so you can find other people that uh, blog this photo and post it like uh, blog stuff that's in this event and post it so it's a also a great way to kind of network too if you <laughs> show off the photos and stuff I think it's pretty cool I think I've gotten Flickr photo maybe three times now it's been really awesome I've been really lucky alrighty so I have all of the items now all I have to do now is unbox um, so I'm gonna do that really quick too another thing that's really cool about this event is that if um, there's ever any updates whatsoever they'll let you know and all you have to do is wear your head again and click that same item and it'll send you the update immediately alrighty then let's get started we are going to wear uh, the blueberry cutie tops first um, so let's I think I have panties on here yeah so let's put on this and take this other blueberry item off this is the Nikita romper 
There we go. Oh look, how cute that is. So it's just a really cute tank top, but it does have a full HUD to it. I like the back to this a lot. Like, look how much detail there is in those straps. Oh, it's kind of like a new HUD too. Here's the button colors. Oh, I don't think it's supposed to say button colors, but it changes the whole top. Oh, look, like I like that there's like little accents on the metals there, so it's almost like a shiny metal. It's not just like into the cloth. I like this. It's a really nice little detail. I like this. So there are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 25, 26, 27 colors in this. And I think it's still the colors that Blueberry uses. Like, So it'll still match like all the other stuff that they have in their store. Um, but I think they just added names to it so you know which one is which. So you can match it to the stuff in their store, which is really cool. Like she'll do a lot of skirts and stuff that will still match tops or shorts and stuff. So you can match up. I think that's really neat. Awesome. So let's keep moving on. We have Candy Doll. And this is a skirt, so we can just put this on with this top. Perfect. The plier I'm wearing, by the way, is Milk Tea, and I'm a huge fan of them. They're like one of the few stores I actually went to and wanted to blog for, personally. <laughs> I asked if I could, and I don't normally do that, so... Uh, let's see. We have our full fat pack HUD for this too, and it's a really cute little skirt. So let's take off this. And let's see. So the first HUD on the very left of this changes all the ruffles on this. The second one on here changes... Does this change the ruffles too? Oh, it has um, opaque lace. Or not opaque. Uh, <laughs> opaque would be this one, where it's just cloth. And then... The second one, it has lace, so there is a sheerness to it. And then the third one changes the actual skirt. How cute is that? I like that. Yeah, I like that a lot. That's really cute. So it does have a bunch of different colors, though, so you can customize it and kind of have fun with it. I like the texture detail on it, too. Awesome. We have Sinful, and this is a heart bikini. So let's put this on. Do I just wear the whole thing? Oh, these are box two. Okay. I don't... Reduce materials and then normal. So there's three versions of this, in case you're not huge on materials. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say. Blueberry comes in Freya, Hourglass, Isis, Maitreya, Physique, and Venus. Candy Doll comes in Freya, Isis, Maitreya, and Hourglass. And then Sinful, let's put these in here. Let's just do the material one because I like a lot of material normally. And this one comes in Freya, Hourglass, Isis, Maitreya, and also Freya Perky. Oh, how cute is that? Holy crap. Sinful is another star I was pretty excited for. Their texturing is always so spot on, and I actually really love their materials. Um, let's see. They also have extremely versatile HUDs as well, so I was very, very excited to see them. I'm not sure what this thing is, though. That's a that's a weird glitch. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what that is. Hopefully that'll be fixed. Um, let's see. This changes the top fabric, the top left. It did it go away? So I guess it was just loading. Yeah, okay. And then uh, let's see what this one does underneath it. It changes the fabric on the back. And then the bottom one is the main bra strap. Oh, how cute. I love that yellow. So let's do browns with this. And then on the other side, the top one does the butt and groin. And then the side straps. And then finally, the bottom one on the very right does the main straps. Very cute. Again, I'm going to do brown, brown, yellow. Oh, so cute. Love it. Okay. I think this might be my favorite so far. I love it. So cute. Sorry, I sound like a man right now, by the way. I'm just, like still waking up. 
Okay, so we have the Empire Sandals. Uh, these come in Freya, Hourglass, Isis, Maitreya, Physique, and Venus. So we add this with the HUD. And let's take off our Essences Sandals from Sold Out. The Chili Heels. And we'll let this load in a bit. Alrighty, so these are actually really cute. I like that they're not like super high gladiators and they just go up to the calf length. And uh, Empire is also really well known for having a very intense HUD as well. Like if you haven't noticed, like all of these items have been full fat packs, super detailed, lots of textures that go into them. Like it's so well done and this is no exception right here. So you can change four parts, five parts of this total. Wow. So you can change on the very left, you can change the metals and the sole of the shoe. And then uh, from left to right on the uh, vertical HUD, no, sorry, horizontal HUD, you can change this uh, actual main part of the shoe. Then you can change the straps that go up to the calf or shin. And then you can change the bottom straps at the very bottom that wrap around your feet. So that's very cute. I like this a lot. Yeah, I like this a lot. So I'm going to go back with the brown theme. And we'll do gold and black for the soul. Well, no, I'll do brown for the soul. Oh, yeah. I love that. So we have foxes and they, uh, this is the one spoiler I did see and it is amazing. It is uh, a one piece. It comes in Lara and Hourglass and we'll take off our sinful bikini, put this on and we do need to hide our nippies, just the little tiny bud and then our bit of our belly. Oh, and a tiny bit of our back. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Oh, that fits so well, though. Like, I never mind a little bit of alphaing if it means, like, I can have, like, a really nice, like, cinched waist like that. Like, it looks so good. Anyways, let's look at this HUD. This might be my favorite one piece Foxes has made. I really like this. The texturing is really nice on it. It comes with four, eight, nine, ten different colors for it. Let's see these. It's like a pink like a light blue what's this one a dark purple that's a really pretty this is black what's up here in the top left then I thought that was black that looks like a dark green these are so pretty yeah I'm definitely like a big fan of one pieces so this makes me very happy from Jean we have chinchillas oh! So we have the pet cage and then we have holdable ones. So this one you hold in your hand and you can click it and change the textures. There are three different textures on it. This is the black one. This is the brown one and this is the gray. You can also stop the animations if you'd like as well as uh, change the animations. So you can't stop them. You just change. Yeah, you can change them up. Okay. So if their animation override is too high for your normal pose you can just go animate animate me and you can uh, turn off the pet pose on animate pet and then this one it looks like that there's two different poses for this where you can hold it or you can hold and pet it which is very cute and then up here this is the one that is the head rummager which is perfect for my beehive hair right now and again you can change the three textures oh there's also white I didn't see that one I'm rambling really badly today too. Ah, oh, strawberry! That's so accurate. <laughs> oh, how cute. I love that. Oh, oh my gosh. And then this is the cage right here. So there's a little one right down here all on its own. The only one. He's just eaten. And it looks like and you can just turn on and off the animations and then with the texture you can change the chinchilla the cage you can change it black, bronze, or silver that was the silver, this is the black, and this is the bronze oh, I like the bronze 
And then toys. You can change these black, blue, and red. Can you open it? Oh, you can! Oh my gosh! How cute is that? This is the blue, and this was the red that we already saw. Oh my gosh, I love that. And it is... I want the land impact. It is 33 land impact, so it's kind of high, but... Oh my gosh, he moves around. Oh. oh my gosh, this is amazing. Does he go in the wheel, too? Or does he just, like, do the water and stuff? It looks like he runs all over his cage. Like, you can see kind of the outline of this where he'll go all over. So I'm going to, just while I do this video, I'll move him behind me. That way, while I record, if anything else changes, we can watch it together. That is so cute. Uh, we'll put him over here. Okay, so let's keep going. We have Lamb next. Oh, he's in his wheel. Oh. <laughs> and I'm really excited to see this hair. Um, it's a quick note. If you're not used to the lamb fat pack, if there is a plus sign next to the lamb hair and the huds, those are the ones that go together. If there's a negative sign next to the hair and the huds, those are the ones that go together. For older hairs, they don't have a negative sign next to the other ones. It's normally just blank. Um, but for these, they separated it a bit easier that if you're wondering why a HUD doesn't work when you're just wearing the basic hair, it might be that it's for the other hair. Where is the Liketeria one? Where'd it go? Oh, it's all the way down here. Oh! Okay, so let's go up here. And this hair is too cute. I really like this bang up here. But lamb, I think, has never failed me. I'm always a huge lamb hat lamb head. Uh, lamb fan. I can't get over that chinchilla. That is amazing. Why did I pick eccentric? I normally wear dark browns. So they come in several huds as well. They have dark blonde, eccentric, home, uh, ombre, variety, black, dark brown, gingers, light blondes, light browns, pastels, reds, and roy jabiv. Uh, so we are going to do dark browns. This is too cute. So let's do this one. Yeah, I'm really liking this. This is so pretty. Oh, I'm prob I might wear this one for the photo. It depends on what the moon hair likes, looks like to you. I love them both. And uh, so this hair was called Home. This one is called Teardrop. I, didn't, I couldn't really get a good look of how this one looked based on the photo. It was kind of covered with the logo, so we'll see. Right, there we go. Finally loaded. And, oh, cute! It's little pigtails! I couldn't see it behind this HUD at first. That's very cute and very good for summer. How cute! <laughs> I like this. I think I might still like the lamb hair top dog but I still really like this too and I'll definitely wear it so I'm very excited about this like oh my gosh this is such a good round Sophia was talking about how good it would be and she wasn't kidding like it is so awesome oh wow so they have the hourglass and Maitreya items separated for paper arrow co so if oh wait no they don't cool so derp <laughs> uh, I need to not be recording oh, am I doing this guys uh, but here we have uh, our Paper Arrow Company pants. So let's take off our shoes and our Fox's one piece. And let's go over this. I'm going to hit show all because it looks like I can wear everything with this. Oh, I want to hide my legs a bit. So we'll hide our upper legs. But I think that's it. Yeah? Yeah. So these are Paper Arrow Company and they are like joggers. Yeah, they're even called joggers. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm really bad at vlogging today. Um, and these come in 10 different textures. And then you can also change the zipper metal, which is on... Where did it go? It's on the sides down here. So you can change it black, gold, and silver. And then, let's see, I want to see this yellow. I love yellow. Oh gosh, yes. This looks so good. Oh, I'm so excited. 
I like how it hangs too. It's not like up to the belly button. Like I like that it's underneath the hip bone. Like this is really cute. And it makes my butt look amazing. I'm very happy with this. I do need to hide my groin too. Like I will say that. But other than that, you hardly had to alpha. Like this is it. And it might have even alpha on its own. I'm not sure. I just automatically wore it and then I hit show all. So uh, we're going to wear June next. And I'm pretty excited for this too because it's um, a store that's a lot like, it's kind of classy and elegant. Like I always think of kind of like a modern businesswoman with the looks. And I think this is gorgeous. I love this. I will say that my leg kind of clips on the side here, which is a bit of a bummer. Um, I'm not quite sure how to hide that. So that, that sort of bites. Um, let's move this. Yeah, I, I don't know how I should, I don't know why that hid that whole thing. But it might just be my alpha too. Like I also have uh, bow-legged legs and stuff, so I don't know. But this is still pretty cute. I love this color, and it comes in eight different colors total. A lot like the ice on HUDs, it has the same mount normally. But I do like this. I think it's very pretty. Aside from that small clipping, I feel like it still fits really nicely. It hugs the hips really well. And Rowan is actually still pretty recent to the mesh body game. Like I think maybe the past six months they've been doing uh, mesh bodies. Like before it was just kind of um, basic fit, like basic mesh fit. So I still think that this is still amazing for how far they've come for just that little tiny bit to show. So I'm definitely a huge Roan fan. I'm happy that they're a guest this month. Um, normally they're n not in this round, by the way. Uh, Sinful, Candy Doll, Roan, and Paper Arrow Company, and Jean are all guest designers. Normally it's like Mish Mish, Ison, um, Flowey, Tifi, and Trey Blah. And I think that's it. Yeah. This is cute, though. This is always my favorite color from Roan. When they did that whole September-August collection, I went apeshit and bought every single item they had. So I guess it's been longer than six months. It's been almost a year now since they got into, like, mesh body stuff. Yeah. Uh, let's see. We have just furniture left. So we have Scarlet Creative, and then we have uh, Tarte. So let's look at these items. Is that the cage that's making those sounds or is it it's my headphones huh okay hopefully that's not showing up in the recording oh my gosh I love this I was uh, I know a few people were hoping for like a home for this but this is freaking beautiful holy crap look at that bake that is so beautiful like Oh my gosh, let's sit down on this. It has solo and couples on this, and I think you can even swap, so there's multiple seats on here, so you can sit with a bunch of friends. Yeah. So it looks like there's 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. There's a lot of sits on this. That's awesome. I wonder how many people, though. Hmm. And then... We have our couple sits right here, and there are one, two, three, four, five different sits on this. And it is 57 land impact. I do, I am floating, by the way, because I uh, did a photo with AJ Arabello yesterday, and um, it was, um, oh, I can't think today. I can't use words. Uh, I'm very short compared to him, so. <laughs> um, I had to adjust quite a bit to fit his size. There we go. So I just moved it onto my beach and maybe I'll do a photo with this later. But let's put up the tart build as well because you guys know I love tart. That's the house I've been building the past few days for my live stream. So we'll see how this one looks. I'm just going to res it out over here too. And it is a church greenhouse. So I wonder if it's going to be like a reconstructed church turned into the greenhouse. Yeah? Or is it just because there's kind of like a steeple? Yeah, no, it's a reconstructed into a greenhouse. How cute is this? Oh my gosh. I wonder if my house needs a greenhouse. 
how much land impact is it? It's only 15 land impact. Uh, yeah, I'm throwing that up here. And then we'll look at it a bit more. Oh, jeez. I have a new neighbor putting stuff out. I always do render them, and they still put up more stuff. And I can always see it, and it's always oogly. I don't want to see their stuff. I already hide them, too, so you can't see other people on the sim, but... Yeah, I have a ton of stuff for greenhouses, and this matches the house pretty well. So I probably will decorate this as like a little added bonus on the live stream, if I'm ever able to get decorating done. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy with this. This whole box was so good. I love it. The little bell at the top, too. Oh, I'm going to put some birds up here. But oh my gosh, kids. guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm done. Um, I'm going to wake up a bit more, but I, I have other subscription boxes that have been in my inventory for like two weeks now, and I don't know if you guys want to watch them or not. I might just open them up on my own if you don't, so let me know if you even want to watch them. But otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I will see y'all later. Oh, I also re uh, grabbed a bunch of gift cards uh, for a giveaway soon. So, uh, those are in here, and I'm also collecting uh, gatches and stuff for the giveaway. A bunch of fr fam uh, friends have given me some. Um, I haven't touched any of them. They'll be in the giveaway. There's a bunch of really good stuff in here, and each of these gift cards is a thousand, but I'll have a whole video for that later on. So, yeah. <laughs> I'll talk to y'all later. Bye, guys.